All right, so this is the first of um, several tutorials that's designed to help you to set up and create the model for your uh, for your design. Um, so here is the um, the model of the site uh, which I've created for you. This is what you'll be create where you'll be creating your um, your design. So um, the first thing that we want to do. Um, is make sure that we've got all the resources that we need um, and you might have to go off and um, and get those sorted. So firstly if you've found the um, the model of the site then that's the first thing that you need but you also need um, a plan of your building. Now you'll notice that it's just a sketch plan but it is in proportion right and it does have one measurement here. Now I didn't draw this to any particular scale, but I've just marked here that that there is obviously not 1300, but rather 13,000 millimeters, so that's 13 meters in essence. Uh, you'll notice that the building that I've designed is very simple. Um, uh, it's got this curved wall in it, in case you want to create some curved walls, I'll show you how to do that. Um, and we're going to use um, some visual arc tools to create these um, columns. Right, so we can just get rid of that for now. Um, so look, I just want to set up our kind of working environment first, um, and then um, I'll pause, create a new video so that you can go away, get your um, plan done if you need to get your plan done, and move on from there. So let's set up our space so that we don't have all of these, these extraneous things that we don't need. So firstly, you'll notice over here, we've got the site and it's all been nested so there's lots of different layers inside of a grander layer called site layer. So uh, we're going to turn off most of them so we don't really need them uh, and as we turn them off we might, in fact I'll just turn them all off and then I'll just turn on the ones that I think will be useful so that's definitely going to be useful and somewhere along the line here that's also going to be useful. So this essentially is our space that we're going to be using and the contour lines because it can be useful to know where the ground level really is as you can see there. Alright so that's the um, that's the first tutorial done so get these uh, get your uh, model in the same sort of um, arrangement as here and get your uh, plan scanned uh, so that you can use it. Alright I'll see you in the next tutorial.